Shalom and blessings to each one of you who have tuned in. We are glad that you could join us to get together to look into God's Word and learn from His Word. We continue with our series of faith from Hebrews 11. And today our focus is on Moses. And we see Moses, how he lived a life of faith. And where in today's verses we see that for him, faith is a choice. Hebrews 11, 24 to 27. By faith, Moses, when he became of age, refused to be called the son of Pharaoh's daughter, choosing rather to suffer affliction with the people of God than to enjoy the passing pleasures of sin, esteeming the reproach of Christ greater riches than the treasures in Egypt. For he looked to the reward. By faith he forsook Egypt, not fearing the wrath of the king, for he endured as seeing him who is invisible. The emphasis that we see in the verses today is the way that Moses made decisions and choices in faith. When we look at Moses' account, we see that the first 40 years of Egypt, he lived as a prince. The next 40 years was in the wilderness. The next 40 years was as a leader for the people of Israel. Through these verses, we see how Moses made choices. So Moses makes a choice initially to refuse many things. So the verse says that he refused to be called Pharaoh's daughter. He refused to enjoy all the fleeting pleasures of sin by being in Egypt and enjoying the fat of the land. And he chooses to, ref to refuse to make Egypt his homeland. We see here that Moses at this time was at the prime of his life and uh, he could have chosen differently. He could have chosen to stay back in Egypt with all the pleasures that were there. But he makes a choice by faith. It, it, Egypt would have looked attractive, but he decides, he makes a choice to go into doing what God wanted him to do. So what does he make a choice? He in turn makes a choice to select different things. He chooses to select to suffer the affliction of the people of Israel. He also chooses to carry the suffering for the sake of Christ rather than all the treasures that were there in Egypt. And he also chooses to bear the rebuke that he would, he would have to bear or he would have to suffer for his obedience to Christ rather than the treasures that were seen in Egypt. He looked ahead to the reward um, that God had promised. Now we see that these were assessments that he made only by faith. And Moses did that because he knew who his God was and he knew what God would fulfill through his life. So just like Moses, you and I are called to make a choice by faith. So let's make a choice that considers the reproach of Christ greater than all that the world can offer to us and continue to look at Christ Jesus. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the word. We thank you that you have taught us to see that faith is a choice and help us to know that we choose the rebuke, the reproach of Christ rather than have the, the sinful pleasures that may be around us. Give us that grace to make such a choice. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.